no, obviously we're of course we're pleased with that result and you know league leaders away from home it was a difficult game for us we knew that coming into it and it proved to be all the way through it was difficult um, they make it very difficult for you you have to be very structurally you have to be very good organised all those things but um, most of all you have to try and match that intensity and, and that's a difficult thing to do um, at a place like this which I know very well so for us to do that I thought we matched them and then especially in the second half we we tried to step ourselves up a little bit um, and we did that and and as you said, you have to deal with the pressure, but then when you get your chances, you have to take them. And I thought they were two really well taken goals and to come here with a clean sheet in a very difficult game for us. Um, yeah, we have to be very, very pleased with that with that result. What, what gave you that extra edge in the second half, do you feel? No, I thought it was, I think we, if you look at ourselves, we tried to step up physically on ourselves, you know, and push ourselves that little bit harder. We were in the first half, um, but I thought we, we were matching them, but we needed to try and get above them, you know, it's a difficult thing to do. So. And then, you know, chances are going to be a little bit more sporadic because of the pressure that they put you under. But I thought we controlled that pretty well. And, and then we took our chances, you know, we're very clinical, fantastic finishes. And um, game plan was good and it worked well. And, you know, it's, the most important bit is, is for the lads. I wanted them to play with their heart, you know. And that's something that we talked about after that, that week where we lost three games in a week. And we were disappointed with that. And since then, the last two games against really strong opposition, Brighton and then today. I wanted them to show that if you play with that heart and of course organisation all those things but when you play with real heart and you put that courage on the pitch you can you can do well and they've done that in the last two games and that was the most important thing out of all of this you know these two games that they saw you know I wanted everyone to see that but them to you know you feel that when you're on the pitch when you're in that zone so that courage that they've shown in these last two games is exactly what we need yeah and just in terms of, of that I mean I saw that you went down the tunnel quite early you wanted it clearly to let them celebrate uh, that particular win in front of the fans and and how important that is for them in the context of this season they've had a lot of questions thrown at them over the last few weeks and two very very strong answers yeah and there'll be more questions to answer there'll be more setbacks of course but um yeah I, I, it's the first time I saw. I said it to you in that week when we lost three games in that week. Um, it's not to get too down about it. You know, we have to keep very balanced. We'll let everyone else get too low or get too high when you win. But um, yeah, we were disappointed with ourselves, and I was disappointed in the players. We spoke a lot about it afterwards, and and then there was the need for response. But the main part was to make sure that they realise that when you step onto the pitch and you wear that shirt and, and what we're doing together, you have to put your heart on that pitch. It takes everything that you've got. And, I think that's the main thing from these two games against really strong opposition, two diff really difficult games. And that's what we have to, as hard as it is in the Champions, that's the demand to put that on the pitch every every single game. And we need to do that in every single game now until the end of the season. Um, and yeah, if we do that, we know we can compete and, and, and be in games to win.